Everything is quiet on the street in southwest Detroit, but those who live here say last night it was filled with sorrow and chaos as word spread quickly of the woman's death. According to those close to Elizabeth Rivera, she was a lovable, kind woman. A loved one who did not want to be identified out of fear of retaliation says she will never get over Elizabeth's death. The 71-year-old was mauled to death by at least one pit bull Saturday night. It's very tragic. Our family definitely suffered a horrible loss. According to this loved one, as well as neighbors who live along Ferdinand Street in southwest Detroit, this is not the first time Elizabeth was attacked by dogs. You can see in this picture the woman was bitten in the face by another pit bull. We're told years ago Elizabeth had to go through extensive surgeries and skin grafts. The pit bull in that case was euthanized. Both dogs in each incident were told were owned by Elizabeth's daughter and her daughter's boyfriend. I was astonished. I couldn't believe it because of what happened prior. I never thought that this would happen again. Right now it's not clear what caused the dog to attack. Loved ones tell me there were four pit bulls taken from the home after after Elizabeth's death, but only one is known as an aggressive dog. Meanwhile, those close to the great grandmother just can't believe she's gone. She was the heart of our family. She was a wonderful, sweet woman, very compassionate. She went to church all the time, and she doesn't deserve this. This should have never happened to her. And no word as to whether any charges will be filed in this case. Detroit police are still investigating. On Detroit's southwest side, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News.